Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So this video has been long time coming. Uh, a while back, I got Aegon, and I maxed him out, took his Sig to 200. We were prepared to take him into the Abyss, but then the Gauntlet hit, and we did that one instead. We depleted a lot of our stash, and we haven't really used Aegon. Well, I always wanted to test him out in Realm of Legends, just to see how far we could get with him. We should be able to go all the way through, um, but that's what we're going to try to do today. Uh, and I'm still not, you know, all that well versed in Aegon, but fortunately, there's not a whole lot that you need to learn. Keep your combo and just keep going. That's pretty much it, right? So let's take a look at his synergies. He has some interesting ones. All right, so let's see. His first synergy here, uh, he's going to get 20% uh, attack rating while fighting larger opponents. Okay, so uh, Aegon, let me see here. I believe Aegon is, is um, medium or small? He's medium, okay? So he's medium. So anyone that's large or extra large, he's going to get a 20% attack bonus against them all right and uh and i believe there are uh a few in realm of legends then you've got this one now this one is actually my favorite because losing my combo is the worst thing for me with these champions especially with aegon it's the worst thing with star lord for sure and proxima not so much but it's really annoying to lose your combo you know, you've worked all the way up. You may have, you know, 100, 200, 300. You lose your combo, and then that's it. So that, to me, is the absolute best synergy to protect that combo. All right, then you've got uh, this one here. And this one, let me see here. Yeah. 25% um, potency to Fury effects. And then you've got this one here. Um, Well-timed blocks, that's parry. Uh, guarantees his next crit, uh, his next hit will be critical. All right, so that's pretty much it. Uh, this one here was just a little bit more crit damage. Um, yeah, we already went over that one. Yeah. All right, so those are the synergies that we have active. All right, I really just wanted to grab that Proxima Midnight one. So let's jump in here and, and see how we do. All right. Hmm. And I am running Suicide, so uh, the damage numbers will be a little bit higher than uh, if you're not running Suicides. So... Uh, Aegon is pretty uh, simple. You just basically fight. Fight like you would normally fight. Just keep hitting them. Build up your combo. Alright, and the higher his combo goes, the more damage you get. Now, I'm going to show you guys his special three. Because the special three stuns the opponent with a good long stun. Now, I'm probably going to push him to a special two um, in this here. All right. But all I'm doing here is trying to get more um, combo here. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Yeah, I figured I would push him, uh, push him to that special two since they don't have um, special threes here. But that's something you have to... Be careful about. Now, I could fire off my special two, but I am honestly not wanting to do any more extra damage because I want to build up that combo. Now, he also, whoops, I, I meant to do a medium ending attack. You'll notice that his combo is, uh, you see that double hit? That's helping. Uh, build up that combo faster having that double hit love it 
but he doesn't even need to fire specials off. So he's great in situations where uh, you, you don't have power. You know, they're draining your power because you really don't care. And once the combo is up, I mean, there's just so much he gets uh, with his combo meters. And I did a video on him a long time ago. Not even with the five star. And he gets this uh, tenacity, which makes him very suicide friendly. Once you get the uh, combo up. And you carry this combo, some of it, uh, over to the next fights. So he's going to carry a lot of this combo up. Uh, over. And then he's going to just keep getting stronger. All the way up to 999 uh, combo. But... I don't know if we will get there uh, in this video, but we'll see. Okay. So, yeah, he's got a lot of hits on his combo meter, but that's what we like to see because he's just getting better and better, more powerful each time. Okay. Almost 200. Almost a 200 uh, combo fight there. However, let's see this next fight here. He's not going to have to ramp up. And I'm normally not a fan of ramp up champions. But his ramp up is pretty straightforward, as you can see. You don't have to jump through any hoops. So he carried over, what is that, 148 of that combo. That is his to keep. For the rest of the quest. Even if I lost my combo in this fight. Doesn't matter. I keep that one. The only thing that would happen. You know say I, I lost my combo at the end of this fight. I would just fail to carry over. Uh, the combo. That's all. And his special two. Is nasty. Special 2 is pretty nasty. Puts a pretty potent bleed on the opponent. But you can see that his damage is already, you know, better than it was when it started on the first fight. Because he started with a higher combo. So pretty much all we do is what you see me doing here. And you'll notice that my um, poison and bleed from Liquid Courage and Double Edge, gone. He shrugs those off now. And he shrugs off any debuffs when he has a high enough combo. And you can see this fight is going much faster. And I love that that Proxima um, synergy because I'm not as worried about losing my combo. Takes a little bit of the stress out of fighting with him. And it just becomes, you know, straightforward, fun. 137. Remember, he has that double hit at the end, so his combo is going to be a little bit inflated. But look at that. We're up to, what is that, 250? All right. So now we've got Juggernaut. Juggernaut! Tenacity kicked in. No poisons. No bleed. I got to watch this guy here a little bit. Because he likes to do that. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's acting up. <laughs> I'm tempted to fire off a, a special two to finish the fight earlier, but no, we'll we'll ride it out. Of 
Fortunately, they don't have a special three, so I don't have to wait that out. <laughs> Old juggernaut. So at least I can... Oh boy, he didn't want to keep attacking me there. At least I can uh, stun him while he's unstoppable. Which, I can understand why they changed it. You know, the unstoppable juggernaut, but you stop him. You know, while he's unstoppable, you stop him right in his tracks. Okay. Yeah, I just hate... Ooh, I almost, almost uh, messed up there. Almost let my finger out. Come on. Yeah, I hate when they do that. <laughs> they Because I can't do a reparry when they do that. Okay. But we're flying along. We're, we're, we're doing good. We're doing very, very good. And here's another one that's annoying. His random unstoppable, unblockable rather, um, is really, really annoying. And Aegon being medium, it's going to trigger more often so i'm gonna try and get this guy in the corner and bait out specials but just look at his damage that's a lot of damage he's already close to a uh, half his health You notice I crit through block because my combo is high enough for that to happen. So look at this. Just just chewing him down. And if I hit him with my special three, it'll probably be over. But I'm trying to get, you know, a lot of combos. Look at that. 8K crits. Oops. Whew. That was nice. We would have lost our combo right there if it wasn't for Proxima. But instead, we kept it. You know, say so that we got hit, but we still kept our combo. Definitely my favorite um synergy for him because that that that's really the only thing that i would have found annoying because right there if we had gotten if we didn't have that uh synergy we would have had no combo to, to uh carry over really because we got hit late and we might have gotten up to like a few hits on the combo meter after losing it so i'm very happy for that synergy Yeah, if you watched my video with uh, Hercules, yeah, we ain't getting one shot against her. He don't have uh, no immortality. He can crit through block like uh, Corvus with a high combo. And he is just chewing her up. That's some damage. When I was doing the gauntlet, one of my biggest regrets was not bringing him in and ramping him up because he would have saved me so many items. He definitely would have. Okay, come on. We'll get her down. Getting a lot of chip damage, but we got her down. And it's going faster and faster as his damage ramps up. Okay. Let's get going. Vision. A fairly easy fight, um, especially since I don't have to worry about any of his specials. 
I can evade his special one. Special two, very easy to evade. They don't have a special three. So we can just keep on going. Look at that. He's already down to like 30. 30% 30 of his health is gone. Hit into his block, still doing damage. Very nice. Yeah, he's when he's ramped up, he's crazy good. I was wondering if he was gonna fire his special off anytime soon. Just look at that damage. And how quick fight's going. See? Even into his block. Doesn't matter. He crit in there now that his combo is high enough. Okay, another uh, pretty straightforward fight here. And his combo is, is keeps rising to the top. And I don't stop. Now, I got to kind of pay attention here because he got a rework and I'm still not 100%. Okay. Uh, with his uh, animations. But you'll notice I'm not even firing off specials. We're just attacking. That's Aegon. He doesn't, he doesn't need to fire off his specials. Okay, I'm getting used to that one. Okay, got used to that one. Yeah, gotta pay attention there. Okay, you know what? Let's fire off a special. I'm talking about how he doesn't need to fire off his specials. Let's fire off a special. Uh, sometimes if I'm like building his combo and I'm in incursions using him or something like that, uh, once I get the, uh, opponent down low, I just do one of them and they're out, you know, uh, I usually will do it when they're about 20%. Depending on, you know, what my combo is looking like. And they tear him up. Okay, now we got Scarlet Witch. Let's see what she got. You gotta watch her. And see her power drain. Aegon don't care. I'm going to hit him with a special three. And just try and get her down a little bit more. But, yeah. Aegon don't care. Yeah, buddy. Let's hit it with a special two. Nasty. Just wanted to show you guys that special two. Did you see that 12K crit? Yeah. Now, here's the man himself. This is the fight that if you don't have a proper counter, you're not getting past this fight. Uh, now... Yesterday, we tried it with Hercules, who does a lot of damage. He was not able to do it, um, at least not 
in a timely manner. So let's, let's see what Aegon can do. Now, Aegon is not all the way ramped up. Oh! Ah, I hate when I do that. I wasn't paying all that much attention and got caught out there. But, thanks to the combo meter, we're still good. Do you see what Wolverine's health looks like already? Look at this. Just that easy. Just that easy, he's done. Now, I still love Hercules. But, yeah. When it comes to that fight, Aegon, for real. All right, let's keep going. Let's see if we can uh, finish this out. I think I think this one they still have him uh lose health on his uh special 2. Yeah. I saw him losing health on his special 2. Uh cuz I know they change that everywhere else, but here um for you guys that don't remember it, weren't playing at the time, uh, Black Bolt, when he fires off his special two, he actually loses health. Okay, come on. Woo! I'm always scared of that one. Because if I get hit with it, it's over with. <laughs> All right. Aegon is just cooking. And now we get the final one. <clears> Hulk. <throat> oh. And he has class advantage. And you can see he has 756 combo. Well, let's see if we can finish this off. I don't want him firing his special one because his special one has like two different uh, ways to uh, evade it. Yeah, we like that one. Fire off that special three. And let's just keep rocking his world. Come on, Aegon. We're going to party like it's your birthday. See some 13k crits in here. Okay, I don't know why it just stopped like that. Okay. Get that out of ya. And it's over with. So that is Aegon taking on a Realm of Legends. We messed up a little bit against uh, Wolverine. But Aegon proved victorious. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you for watching the video. Like I said, it was a long time coming. Uh, I, I meant to do this, you know, months and months ago. But we finally got her done. Uh, so take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. If you don't know about Aegon, do a search on my channel. And I go over everything he gets at uh, different combos okay so uh take care and you all have a blessed day